after losing the GCW World Championship at WrestleMania 11, what is next for Will Ospreay and what is next for his United Empire? After losing the title at WrestleMania, it's time to hear Ospreay speak. Well, there's no use hiding it. What happened at WrestleMania? The real world champ lost his title. Despite the fact that I am still the best professional wrestler on the planet, I'm man enough to admit when I was beat. And I'm sure all of you were expecting me to call out Roman Reigns and the Bloodline and G-Man and go right back after the championship. But there's something deeper going on here. But before I go any further, it's with great regret and disappointment that I must announce that not only is Veer dealing with a brutal rib injury by the hands of some fat, but also my right hand man, Gunter, the first man to join my United Empire, will be the first to part ways from it. Wait, what? Wow. We discussed it backstage, and he feels it's time to go his own way. And I respect that. Thank you, bruv, for everything. Maybe you and I will main event WrestleMania one day. I gotta say, this is completely unexpected from Osprey and the United Empire. Yeah, I'm kinda shocked. So there it is. No championship, no empire. I'm left with nothing. And you might wonder why that is, huh? Everything was going absolutely perfectly for me until one man stepped into a GCW venue. Any guesses? Yeah, that's right. GCW Elimination Chamber 2023. The powers that be decided we needed an impartial guest referee for the GCW versus FAW war. Impartial, huh? The stage creator. Right. I wasn't pinned or submitted since winning the GCW championship, bruv. And that fuck. Sorry. Sorry, gotta watch my words here. I hear that person count to three when I clearly kicked out, bruv. That's what you call impartial, huh? You know, I have to admit, bruv, you've been getting in my head. I mean, would I have lost at WrestleMania if you had stayed home in your extreme garbage promotion? Unlikely. Even though this is an unfortunate situation right now, it kind of feels like it was meant to be. Honestly, bruv, you've been in my head way before the Elimination Chamber. Boy, there's that loud-ass kid again, clearly a fan of stage creator and not a fan of what Osprey's saying right now. Oh, and there, you see why. Actually, you, you know what? Security, help this little fellow in the ring for a moment. What? <laughs> no way. Yes, for real, get him in here. Uh, okay, I guess the kid is gonna live his dream and get in a GCW ring with the former world champ. I mean, that is interesting. I gotta say, this is very unorthodox. I did not expect any of this after Osprey lost the belt at WrestleMania. <laughs> yeah, me neither. This right here, bruv, is the perfect representation of the fan base of your shit fed. Who else would watch respectable wrestlers fight in a toilet, bruv? Or even better, shape-shifting dogs that interfere in world title matches. A put together man that has his finances, sex life, and drip on point. No! Disgusting! 
TikTok addicted dopamine seeking kids like him. That's what you make a living off of, bro. Anyway, speaking of your shit fed, you know what else is shit? You, as a wrestler, you lose to CM Punk at your first WrestleMania ever. Hell, you couldn't even beat G-Man. Oh, oh, but you were the world champion, right? Oh yeah, I remember. You made yourself win, money in the bank, and cashed in. But oh no, it didn't go over so well on Instagram, did it? You couldn't handle that heat, huh? The almighty stage creator received some criticism. Oh no, and you couldn't take it. You couldn't take the pressure and pussied out and dropped the belt immediately. See, that's the difference between you and I. I held on to that world title for a whole year despite what anyone else thought. No matter what was thrown at me, I overcame it. I am a man who stands up for what he believes in. You are a people pleaser. You get up in the morning to please annoying little shits like him. To please the almighty algorithm because your purpose in life is to sell the fuck out. You have made a joke, a mockery out of the craft I dedicated my fucking life to! And that is why I'm challenging you to a match at Extreme Rules! Oh. And you know what? I'm even willing to do this your way! Hardcore match! I will lower myself to your level to end the monster you have created! I will restore the dignity in professional wrestling by destroying you in your own playground. And after I'm done, I'm burning the whole thing to the fucking ground and sending this company, hell, this whole platform in YouTube free from your grip. Ball is in your court, bro. Talk about a blockbuster statement! The former JCW champion, Will Ospreay, has agreed to face the stage creator in his own creation of hardcore infamy. Now we just gotta wait and see if the stage creator will actually accept the challenge from Ospreay. For more videos from the road to GCW Extreme Rules, click the screen right here.